Well, I'm back again. I started putting the plywood on the sides of the boat. I got three pieces on. As you can see, uh, I got one on the back here this morning. You can notice all the clamps. It takes a lot of clamps to hold it. I've already taken some of them off because I've got about 120 screws in there. Probably the screws will hold it without the epoxy. <laughs> and I'll take you down the other side and show you that I got most of that done. It's going to get cold, to, a little colder tomorrow, so probably won't get much done. Takes too much to heat the garage up, even though I've got it well insulated. Get a small heater. That's coming along fine. Next we'll do the, I'll finish the sides and then I'll start on the bottom. I hope we'll have it done by summer. If not, next summer. Here's my little heater. Not very big, but it does the job. Here's a picture of the last boat I made. Similar size, but uh, it's all, it was all made out of uh, cedar, cedar planking. And it, uh, it was a nice boat. It was 19 foot 6, about the same beam in it. But this one has a much larger uh, hull on the bottom. Well, I'm going to sign off for now. Just give me a little glance around the shop here. This is the rest of the plywood here. There's the garage door I insulated. Works great. Ceiling's got plenty of insulation in it. About 12 inches up there. So a little heater actually does a pretty good job of bringing up to 70 in here, and that's all I need. Okay, talk to you later. See you later. Bye bye.